We'll guide you through how to add music to an image on your iPhone. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, we're going to need an app to go and do this. So close out of your photos and open the app store. And the app you want is called CapCut. CapCut is a video editor and video maker. So go and get it. There is a paid version of it, like a subscription, but we can just use the free version. Once you've got it, open it up and click on edit in the bottom left and then click on new project. And you need to find the photo you wish to add music to. So it's essentially we're gonna go and create a video with just a still image, but we need to have a video format to add the music. You could add multiple images as well. In this case, I'll just add one though. So select the photo you wish to go and use. You just click on it in the top right and it'll select it. And you can then press add in the uh, bottom right. And then here it is. So first of all, you can go and change the size of the image and how it's going to be. If you selected anything in the timeline, just press the back button in the bottom left, go to the bottom and click on aspect ratio, and you can then use these different ratios. For example, you may want to use this sort of square, and then you can click on it um, in the preview and you can pinch it to fill it out just like so. Once you're happy with it, press the tick, and you can then press the back button in the bottom left. And then what we can do is go and add some music. To do that, you just go and click on audio at the bottom, then click on sounds. At the top, you've got music from CapCut. So go and click on a type and you can then see these different types. And if you wish to use it, you can click on the download button and you can then go and add it. Or at the bottom, you can go and use sounds from TikTok. You can then use your own audio, audio you've extracted, audio from your device, and also um, iTunes music. So that's music you've gone and synced from iTunes on your computer to your phone. Um, so let's say I want to do some of that. I can scroll down and find a song. I'll use this cartoon one. I'll press the add button and it's now gone and added it. So it's important to note that because we're creating a video, we can decide how long um, it's going to be. So at the moment it's only three seconds. So what I wanna do is just go and click the photo and you see these points at the start of the video and the end, you just click on them and then drag it like so. So let's say I want it to be 10 seconds, I'll then put it there and then we can come down to the music. And let's say I want the music to go and start here then what I can do is just grab this start point and drag it like so. And that's just right there. And then what I can do is click it again and I click and hold and drag. I can push it right to the start, just like so. I'll move it a bit more, but as soon as the video starts, the music starts at the right point. And then what I like to do is have the music and video finish at the same time, which is just here. So I'll then click on the music. I'll click on split in the bottom and then I'll select the part I wish to delete and I'll then press delete in the bottom. And it's that simple. And then once you finish, you can press the export button in the top right, we'll say exporting, and it's now been saved. If I come back to my photos, I can then go and find it at the bottom, just here. And it's that simple. So as you can see, it's completely still, but it's got music. 